can you solve this geometry challenge? Here's the question. Let's start with a right triangle with a side length of x plus 5, x plus 3, and 2x plus 4. Then our goal in this question is to find the value of x. Now you can pause this video if you want to give this problem a try. Now suppose you pause this video. Now let's see if you got the correct answer. All right. So given this right triangle, with the side length 2, x plus 4, x plus 5, and x plus 3, our goal is to find the value of x so that we have a legit right triangle. And of course, to have a legit right triangle, this x plus 5 must be greater than 0. It follows that x must be greater than negative 5. Also, this side length x plus 3 must be greater than 0. It follows that x must be greater than negative 3. And this 2x plus 4 must be also greater than 0. So it follows that x must be greater than negative 2. Now, if we get the intersection of those ranges of x, we can say that x must be greater than negative 2. So this will help us to identify the correct value of x. So now, let's solve this question. Of course, using, since it is a right triangle, using the Pythagorean theorem. So, a squared plus b squared equals c squared. So, if we apply the Pythagorean theorem in our right triangle, we have x plus 5 raised to the power of 2 plus x plus 3 raised to the power of 2 equals 2x plus 4 raised to the power of 2. Now, if we expand x plus 5 raised to the power of 2, we get x squared plus 10x plus 25. Also, if we expand x plus 3 raised to the power of 2, this will give us x squared plus 6x plus 9. And if we expand 2x plus 4, this will give us 4x squared plus 16x plus 16. Now at this point, let's combine like terms. We have x squared and x squared. So if we combine this, we have 2x squared. Next, 10x and 6x. So we have 16x. 25 plus 9, this is 34. Now, subtract 2x squared on both sides. This is just 2x squared on the right-hand side. Neg 16x and 16x on left and the right side. If we subtract 16x, this is just 0. So we have 34 equals 2x squared plus 16. Subtract 16 on both sides. 34 minus 16, this will give us 18. Divide both sides by 2, this is just 9. So, to solve for the value of x, let's get the square root on both sides. And since we have an even power of x, so we have two possible values here. We have positive or negative. And there you go. Square root of 9 is 3. Square root of x squared is x. So we have positive or negative 3 equals x. Now, we found x equals positive or negative 3. But take note that x is greater than negative 2. So negative 3 cannot be a value for x. Therefore, we eliminate the negative value of x. And therefore, we can say that the only value of x that satisfies this triangle or the value of x that we have a legit right triangle must be equal to positive 3. And this is our answer to this question. And as always, we are done.